uh, we're going to talk about alcohol and fat loss. How to actually continue to enjoy some of those things that we enjoy as adults and make sure that it doesn't affect that waistline as much. Um, first off, I think the biggest thing is the moderation side of it. So try to limit your alcohol intake overall. Try to get in less calories from liquids. So if you are someone who enjoys beer or cocktail drinks, like mixed drinks with pop in it or high calorie options, the best option or the best way to go would be to reduce the calorie intake from those. So choose some better options. Choose a vodka soda, choose red wine, choose a lighter beer option. Those would be the quickest way to reduce your calorie intake overall. When you are going out to drink and you're drinking, try to avoid bad food. Usually bad food goes with you know, a lot of alcohol, they're hand in hand, or a lot of alcohol goes with some maybe not the best food choices. So if you're going out to drink, just drink. Try to avoid the late night drive through, try to avoid the next day when you're hungover, choosing a high fat option or choosing a, like a deep fried option. It will help you out overall. Now, while you're out drinking, big suggestions, keep your potassium intake up. So if you are drinking high potassium items, avocado, sweet potato, uh, bananas, those items that are higher in potassium will help you not get as dehydrated, thus you won't, f well, some won't feel as hungover, and uh, there's a few factors with that, but we'll keep it as simple as possible. Other than that, when you are out, if you can have, for every drink, have a big tall glass of water, after a drink, have a big tall glass of water, thus reducing the chance that you're dehydrated at the end of the night and the next day, and again, you're going to be drinking more liquids overall, you'll get to a certain point that you can't drink so much. When you are drinking, try to keep it to three drinks when you're out, or even better, try to keep it at three to five drinks a week. That would be the quote unquote moderation that we have right now. Um, other suggestions while you're in within the day, there are some tips that I can give you guys. Uh, little things would be keep the protein intake up, keep the veg intake up. Because alcohol is a carbohydrate and a sugar carbohydrate, maybe you just don't wanna eat as many carbs and keep the carb intake low for that day. Uh, days you are enjoying a beverage, if you can get out and get in a workout before, so you know Friday night you're going out for some red wine and uh, maybe some socialization. As you can tell, I don't go out much. I'm getting back to what I was saying. If you are going out, you know you're going out for an evening to enjoy yourself. Try having less calories overall and just really watch your food intake. So maybe in the morning you're having some egg whites and eggs and maybe you're throwing some veggies in an omelet. Um, maybe for lunch you're having some chicken or turkey and a lot of greens in forms of a salad. Uh, maybe for supper, again, you're choosing a white fish or a lean protein option along with a lot of greens. And then go out and enjoy yourself. So that's what would encompass my strategies for you. So first of all, again, eat less calories overall. Choose the booze over the booze and food. Second of all, try to get in more potassium and more water within your day. Third of all, just try to get in more protein and more greens and less carbohydrates overall. Those would be my th kind of three tips if you are drinking and are working in a fat loss phase. Just realize you will have to be in a calorie deficit over time to lose body fat. So be mindful of that when you are going out and drinking as probably more frequently than you think or going out to have some higher calorie options more frequently than you think. Hopefully that uh, helps you guys out. And